Nutrient pollution is a widespread national problem and is well documented in places like the Chesapeake Bay, the Mississippi River Basin, Puget Sound, and here in Jackson Hole. Nutrients like nitrogen and phosphorus are a natural part of the ecosystem. They support the growth of aquatic plants. But human activities cause an excess of nitrogen and phosphorus in the environment. Surface and groundwater become polluted, creating a serious problem called nutrient pollution. In Teton County, nutrient pollution has impacted drinking water in the Hoback area and fueled nuisance algae growth in Fish Creek. Pollutants often enter upstream waters like creeks and streams and then flow into larger bodies of water like lakes and rivers. Nutrient pollution can affect your family's health as it threatens our drinking water supply and places where we like to swim and fish. Excess nutrients can also cause an explosion of algae growth called algal blooms. These can be foamy, scummy, or a thick mat of slime on the surface of the water or along the shore. Some algal blooms are harmful because they produce toxins that can make people sick. Significant increases in algae harm aquatic habitats by severely reducing oxygen in the water that fish and other aquatic life need to survive. Nutrient pollution hurts tourism, reduces property values, and drives up water treatment costs, making it one of the most serious water pollution issues facing our community. Nutrient pollution comes from lawn fertilizer, septic systems, and sewage treatment plants, stormwater runoff, and animal waste. Limiting these sources of nutrient pollution will protect people's health and the environment, support the economy, and keep our water safe for swimming and fishing. Awareness is the first step in preventing and reducing nutrient pollution. But we're not stopping there. The time is now to protect our water. Learn what you can do to make a difference at protectourwaterjh.org.